Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another video and today we'll be testing some more GTA 5 clothing glitches that I found on TikTok. So I've gathered a bunch of different TikToks to test out in today's video and hopefully we'll find some decent clothing glitches. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video or find it helpful. If you do, feel free to leave a like. Now let's get straight into the first TikTok. So to start off, we are going to be testing out this glitch here and it is how to get the bodysuit with pants on it. So this is an old glitch that used to work. However, I do want to test it out to see if it still works. And just to mix it up, I'll try it with a different bodysuit as well. So first of all, we want to go into the outfits, bodysuits, and then it did say to equip any of the first three. However, I'm going to try using this skeleton bodysuit. And then from here, we just want to head over to any barber shop. Now in the barber shop, we just want to press right D-pad to sit down. And then in the TikTok, it did say to go down to the chest and then purchase the shaved. So if yours is shaved, just change it to natural or anything else and then change it back to shaved. Then after this, we're supposed to go up to the contacts and then change our contact lenses. So I don't think it really matters which contacts you go for. Anyway, that should be it. So from here, we just need to get out of the seat and stand up and we should have some pants on our bodysuit. And there you go, it does seem to work. So on this skeleton bodysuit, we seem to get the standard jogging pants. And considering it works with the skeleton bodysuit, I'm assuming it still works with the other bodysuits as well. And feel free to try it on whatever bodysuit you want to use. Um, but from here, I'm going to test to see if we can change the pants. I don't think we can though. Yeah, so it doesn't seem like we can change the pants. However, you can save this outfit and it is a pretty cool outfit to have. But that is it for this first outfit glitch, so that one was a success as it did work. Anyway, on to the next clothing glitch. Next up is how to get a hood on any outfit in GTA 5. So I know this glitch used to work for sure, and you were able to get a hood on t-shirts and regular jackets as well, and also no top. Now I'm fairly sure this glitch does still work, however it is a slightly different method to in this TikTok, and the method in fact is actually slightly easier. So anyway, I'll just get straight into showing you how to do it. So first of all, just make your outfit how you want it. So choose your pants, shoes and your gloves. Now for tops, if you are going for a top that lets you equip a utility vest on it, you need to equip number 43, which is the peach plate carrier. And that is necessary in order to merge the hood onto your outfit. And it also works with no top as well. So just equip that utility vest on no top and you can get a hood without a top. Now for me, I'm going to use a baseball jacket and I'm going to use this one here. So if you use a jacket, you need to set the jacket to open using your interaction menu and then head back onto tops and head down to designer t-shirts then equip the black print t-shirt. So again, this is necessary in order to merge the hood onto this outfit. So from here, go ahead and save the outfit in slot number one. Once you've saved it, head down to the mask store. If you guys are looking for some of the quickest and safest GTA Cash rank services and modded accounts for PlayStation, Xbox and PC, be sure to check out Damn Mods. You can also use my coupon code TJRH for a discount on your order. And as you can see, they have excellent reviews on Trustpilot and are trusted by thousands of customers. Now over here, go on the hat section, head down to the bulletproof helmets and then equip the black bulletproof helmet. Then go to the mask menu and then head down to gas and you want to equip the chemical mask. Once you have this, just save this in slot number one again. So overwrite the save. Then back out of this menu, open up your interaction menu and then equip the outfit we just saved a few times just to make sure the game saves. Now open up your pause menu, go to online, jobs, play job, rockstar created, goal missions and start up any mission. In the mission, you should notice that your mask and your helmet has disappeared. So if it has, just go to an ammunition store in the mission. If your mask and helmet didn't disappear though, restart your game and try this again. Inside of the ammunition store, go onto any menu and then go ahead and save this outfit in slot number one again. So again, you want to overwrite the save and then quit the job using your phone. Now, once you load in, just go opposite you into the ammunition store and then go into the outfit section and head down to onesies. Now, equip any colored onesie that has the hood you want with your outfit. So for me, I'm going to use the lemon onesie. 
Once you have your onesie equipped, just open up your pause menu, you want to head over to online, jobs, play job, this time go to bookmarked, then missions, and you'll need to start up It's a G thing, so you will need to bookmark this on Social Club. I'll leave a link to it in the pinned comment, so if you don't have it, just bookmark it, then restart your game, and it should appear, so you can start it up. And then in this menu, set the clothing to player saved outfits, and then invite anyone and start this up. Now in this menu here, on owned outfit, just scroll one to the right and then ready up. Now in the mission, you want to go to one of your apartments and then go to the wardrobe inside of your apartment. Now in your apartment wardrobe, you want to go ahead and save this outfit to any slot, so you can save it in slot one again if you want to and then quit the job using your phone. Now when you load in, you can open up your interaction menu and equip the same outfit you just saved in the mission, and you'll notice it is there fully saved. And there we go, the hood on any outfit glitch does still work, it's just a slightly different method. Anyway though, onto the next TikTok. Next up is another glitch that has worked for a long time, however it did get patched with the telescope glitch being patched. However we do have a new workaround for this which I'll show you. So with this you can get the pouches on pretty much any outfit, it works with any of these outfits under grassland armour on the KO Perico heist, so any of these pouches you want you can choose. Then once you have the outfit with the pouches you want equipped, just remove the hat and then go ahead and save it to any slot. It also works with the black pouches which are on the outfits under the infiltration upgraded tech on the diamond casino heist outfits. Anyway, once you have saved the outfit, you want to head down to Outfits, Heist, Coveralls, and then make sure you have any of the last four purchased, so any of those, with a gas mask, and then re-equip this outfit with the pouches, then head down to the mask store. Over here, go into the hat section, head down to the bulletproof helmets, and you want to go for the black bulletproof helmet, and then after you have this, go on the mask menu, on this menu, head down to Gas, and then you want to go for the Chemical Mask. Once you have this, just go ahead and save this outfit in the same slot that you saved it in before. Then back out of this menu, open up your Interaction menu, and then equip the outfit we just saved about 3 or 4 times. Now open up your Pause menu, go to Online, Jobs, Play Job, Rockstar Created, head down to Missions, and start up a Titan of a Job, or any mission. If you load in and the pouches are floating and you have no gas mask or helmet, that means it has worked. However, if the pouches aren't floating, you will have to restart your game and try this again. But if it has worked, just go to an ammunition store in the mission. Now go ahead and save this outfit in the same slot that you saved it in before, and then quit the job using your phone. From here, go to any clothing store. Now in the clothing store, you can go ahead and make your own outfits and you'll notice on the majority of clothing items that the pouches do stick. There are certain items where the pouches don't stay. Once you've made your outfit, you can go ahead and save it. And clearly this glitch still works, so anyway, on to the next TikTok. Next up, we have how to get green, orange, and purple body armor with deadline outfits in GTA 5. So we are gonna need to do the transfer glitch and equip the components that are in this video. So the rest of the video is pretty long as it shows us what items to equip. So instead, I'm just gonna follow the TikTok and show you guys, and you guys can follow along with me if you want to. So I'll show you how to do the transfer glitch as well, and all of that. So first of all, we wanna head over to a clothing store. And you want to go up to the front counter. Also, before we begin, make sure you put your money in the bank. So instead of having a lot of cash, just put it in the bank so it transfers over to your female character. 
Now, if you didn't know, the transfer glitch does delete all your saved outfits except for the one you equip. So equip the outfit you would like to keep, and then delete all your saved outfits yourself, just to make sure it goes smoothly. Now, open up your pause menu, go down to online, and head down to swap character or manage characters if you are on new gen. In order for the glitch to work, your main character needs to be a male and it needs to be in the left slot or else it won't work for you. Now from here, make a new female character in the right slot. And if you get this alert, accept it. In this editing menu, make sure you set your character to a female and then press save and continue. Name the character anything and then you should load into a public session after you take the photo. Now when you load in, open up your map to see if you have any clothing stores appearing on the map. If you don't, just find a new session and they should appear. I would recommend finding a new invite only session, just so no one else can mess up the glitch while you're doing it. Now when you load in, just head over to any clothing store. Now to start off, we're supposed to go onto the pants section and then head down to the utility pants. You want to go for the black battle pants. From here, go on tops and then we need to head down to the work jackets and go for number 38. This should be the peach camo closed field. Once we have this, we then want to go down to tucked t-shirts and go for number 75, which should be the blue digital t-shirt. Now that we have this equipped, we want to go to the accessories menu. So from here, make sure you remove any earrings that are currently on your outfit. So equip no earrings. And if you have any necklaces or other accessories, just remove them and then head down to gloves. And on gloves, go for the light woodland armoured and then save this in slot number two. Then we're supposed to name this first outfit green one. Then once you have saved this to slot number two, we also want to save it in slot number four and name this orange one. Then after we have saved it in slot number four, we also want to save it in slot number six and name it purple one. Anyway, once we have all those outfits saved, we want to go to the pants section and then head down to sports pants and equip the spotted muscle pants. So these should be number one. Once we have those, we want to go onto tops and then head down to the fitted suit jackets and equip the black boating blazer. Now, once we have this equipped, we want to back out of this menu, open up your interaction menu, and then we want to head down to the health and ammo, body armor, and then show the super light armor. If you are on old gen, the body armor might still be under inventory. From here though, we want to go onto the shoe section, then head down to motorcycle boots and equip number 23. Now we want to save this outfit underneath green 1 and name this green 2. Now back out of this menu, open up your interaction menu, head down to your body armor again, so either under health and ammo or inventory, and then scroll 1 to the right over to the light armor. Now head back onto motorcycle boots and equip number 22. After you have these, save this outfit underneath orange 1 and name it orange 2. From here, just back out of this menu again, open up your interaction menu, go to your health and ammo, go onto body armor, and you wanna scroll one to the right over to the heavy armor. Once you have this, you just wanna go back onto shoes. Now head down to motorcycle boots and then go for number 21. Now that you have these, we want to save this underneath purple 1 and name it purple 2. So now we should have all the outfits made. And then from here, what you want to do is open up your pause menu, go to online, then head down to options. Take the easy way out just to force the game to save. Now this is the part where we need to do the transfer glitch, so open up your pause menu, go to online, head down to Rockstar Creator. Now in this menu head down to create a race and then create a new land race, so go on race details, 
and you want to fill this in essentially so the title, description and photo don't matter, they can be anything. Now head down to maximum players and set this to 3, and then set the route type to point to point, and if you want to you can choose any supercar or any car in the game that you want to use just to test the race. From here though, warp to the airport. Now head down to placement and then place the trigger anywhere, take a photo of anything for the lobby camera. Now you want to place checkpoints until the race is at least 0.62 miles long, so when that red warning icon disappears, which is about 0.62 miles I believe. Once you have done this, just test the race. Now once you get this alert, just accept it and then open up your pause menu, head over to online and you want to head down to choose character or manage characters. Now in this menu just delete your female character. Now from here if you are on old gen just back out to story mode, however on new gen in order to go into story mode you want to hover over the character on the right and then you want to join someone from your friends list who is in a GTA online session who is in a different targeting mode to you. So for Xbox there is a bot account that you can join which I just showed you and that will work and there's also an account similar to this on PlayStation that you can just join and when you join just accept the alert and wait and it should kick you straight to story mode. When you load into story mode just start up a new online invite only session. Now you should load in with the outfit you chose to keep at the beginning so from here go ahead and save this at the bottom so to slot number 20. You should also notice all the outfits we made on the female character have transferred over so from here go on to deadline outfits and for the first one we want to equip the deadline green outfit and then we need to open up our pause menu go to online head down to jobs play job Go on to bookmarked, head down to missions and you'll need to start up it's a G thing so you will need this bookmarked if you don't have it I'll leave a link to it in the pinned comment so if you don't have it just bookmark it then restart your game and it should appear. In this menu here just set the clothing to player saved outfits and then invite anyone and start this up. In this menu here just scroll over to the green two outfits so that'll be two to the right and then from here you can ready up and as you can see it has merged together so it does seem to work and then if we keep scrolling over we can see that we can also get the orange and purple body armor so you'll want to use different deadline outfits for those just to match the color. When you load in you want to go to one of your apartments and then go to the wardrobe inside of it. Now in here go ahead and save your outfit so just save it out the way of the others just save it at the bottom so slot number 19. After you have saved it just delete green 1 and green 2 then quit the job using your phone. Now when you load in you should be able to equip that same outfit we just saved using your interaction menu and you'll notice it is fully saved. So there we go that TikTok has fully worked and you can obviously repeat this to get the orange and the purple body armour. However if you want you can just equip the matching coloured deadline outfit full of matching armour and then just repeat what we just did in order to get that armour as well. Anyway that is definitely a success as that TikTok did work and that's all the TikTok's done for today's video so I hope you did enjoy or find this helpful. If you did feel free to leave a like. Anyway thank you for watching have a great day or night and I'll hopefully see you in the next one. Take care.